Wernambi is a genus that consisted of two species of very large snakes. These species were not pythons, like Australia's other large constrictors of the genus Moralia, and are currently classified in the extinct family Madsoeidae. This genus was a part of the extinct megafauna of Australia. Diversity the type species is Wernambi naricortensis, a 5 to 6 meter long snake. The only other known species is Wernambi barrier. Description. Wernambi seems to have been an ambush predator. Rather than using venom, the animal would kill its prey by constriction. The head of the animal was small, restricting the size of its prey. Taxonomy and naming. Wernambi naricortensis was first described from fossils collected at Naricort, South Australia, the first extinct snake to be found in Australia. It was given the name Wernambi from the description by the local Aboriginal people of a serpent of the Dreamtime. This serpent, a mythological being commonly referred to by both Aboriginal people and Europeans as the Rainbow Serpent, was often held responsible for the creation of major features of the landscape. The waggle of the Western Australian Noongar people is thought to correlate to the South Australian people's Wernambi. It is cognate with the Yolungur genus, found at Riversley in Queensland and in the Northern Territory, which was up to 9 metres long with a body about 30 centimetres in diameter. The family of the species, Madzoeidae, became extinct in other parts of the world around 55 million years ago, but new species continued to evolve in Australia. These species are the last known to have existed, becoming extinct in the last 50,000 years. Ecology Wernambi naricortensis lived during the Pleistocene Ice Age period, in natural sun traps beside local waterholes, where they would ambush kangaroo, wallaby and other prey coming to the water to drink. For this reason, children were forbidden in Aboriginal culture to play at such places, and only allowed to visit when accompanied by an adult. Mapping such locations in Western Australia has been found to be closely associated with areas the Noongar people regard as Wargal sacred sites. Tim Flannery claims that this animal, along with other Australian megafauna, became extinct as a result of activities of the Australian Aborigines.